today we're working on a 1997 Isuzu Rodeo for an AC inspection. Now in the past, to do an AC inspection, a technician would have to measure the temperature of each line individually, either with a thermometer or by hand, and have to learn basically what each temperature feels like and know if the system is working correctly. Now that is a little bit time consuming and it's not always the most accurate. So today I actually have a tool from Fluke, it's a visual thermometer, a VT02, that we're going to use to take a quick snapshot of the AC system and we'll be able to see almost instantaneously what the system is doing and how it is performing. And one of the first things I'm going to check is going to be the condenser temperature on this. Now I've got the front grill removed so that we have a little easier access to see it. And what's nice with this tool, it's actually a digital camera with thermal added. So you can, you can see in the clear lens exactly what you're looking at, and then you use the arrow to start to blend in your temperature. So as we blend in our temperature, you can begin to see that our condenser is uniformly warm across the entire span of the condenser. You can also see our discharge line that runs in the front is a little bit warmer than the rest, which is normal. We want to see about a 20 to 30 degree temperature drop across our condenser. Now also, we would be looking for any cold spots on that condenser that would indicate a restriction or a blockage of Freon flow and may cause the system to not function properly. We can also use this on our low side line coming off the evaporator core. This system uses an expansion valve, so we're going to see a large temperature difference between our liquid line going in and our low side line coming out. If this was an orifice tube system, you actually want to see those two lines the same temperature or within one and two degrees of each other, which would indicate a fully charged system. So here, just like on the condenser, we can focus in and we can see our low side line and we can see our liquid line and then we'll blend in our temperature and you can see that that low side line is quite cold by the green coloring on the screen compared to our liquid line which is showing in red on the bottom. So we know this AC system is performing as it should. Now the other beautiful thing about this you can actually take an image and record it to an SD card to show your customer or to keep for your own records. So if you have a customer that's doubting your diagnosis of a clogged condenser, you can actually show them on the screen where your temperature difference takes place and prove to them why they need to replace the condenser and why it is so important in an air conditioning system.